Bay in four, Penshurst last five, Compton Fabio in seven, and Bayside in box number eight. That's the field for the ninth event. They're all locked away for the exchange printers over the 400. Set. Ready. And away. Sienna Bay bounced nicely on the inside, leads four lengths settling down. Penshurst last second, then came on the outside Bayside, a couple away then Seabomb Bay, and Compton Fabio sees them all. Off the back, and Sienna Bay, the one to run down. It's still four in front. In second place in Bayside, followed by Seabomb Bay, Penshurst last, but up the straight at Sienna Bay clear, and Sienna Bay scores by four. Bayside got second, third went to Penshurst last in front of Seabomb Bay, and back at the rear of the field was Compton Fabio. Race time around 23 and 60. 10.98 that first split. But no problems for the favourite Sienna Bay. Best to begin, sprung three in front and uh, was never headed from that point onward. Second went to eight Bayside, chased hard throughout and third to number five, uh, Penshurst Lass. 23 and 64 was the race time recorded by the winner, number one, Sienna Bay, taking out race number nine on the card. This Greyhound, the Brindle Bitch, March 20, by Bad Boy Tex from Millie Bay, and makes it career win two from six starts, owned and trained by Andrew Graham. Scored by three and three quarter lengths, with the margin between second and third, four and a quarter. Andrew trained the second Greyhound, number eight, Bayside, and Bayside.